Hey guys, um, I'm back again. Um, I just really wanted to thank Vlogger Forum for being my first subscriber to my channel. It's amazing and I'm really grateful, even though I can't really understand what you saw in my video that <laughs> made me so appealing. Um, anyway, to the rest of you, I apologise for the last video which was my first and therefore kind of full of, um, 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 but I've made a foolproof plan this week that that will not happen. It's not this week. It hasn't been a week. It's only been a few days. I really can't count. But more importantly, I've made a plan and that plan is that I am no longer going to use the word um. And I bet you I will use the word um at least three times within this vlog, if not more. That is not important, however. What is important is that spring is here. Now, you can tell that spring is here because, as usual, there is blossom everywhere. And when I say blossom everywhere, I mean everywhere because this morning I woke up with blossom in my bed. I don't understand how that happened. I don't even know how that's physically possible. Especially considering that they cut down all the trees on my road last week. So there is nowhere effectively that the blossom can come from. So, aside from the miracle of spring and magic blossom, also I think that nature lovers will be interested to hear that I've made a new friend in, uh, oh my god, where is he? In Jim. Jim is a spider who lives in my room. Usually I'm terrible with spiders, but I've decided that, you know, for the good of the world, I need to learn to coexist, and therefore Jim is living in my bedroom unscathed. It's kind of creepy because he seems to follow me around. Like, I started out on that side of my room and Jim just appeared from the wall and I was like, okay, spider, backing away now. And um, every time I move, he comes with me. And so I'm sensing some sort of spidey attraction that I'm not particularly happy about. Not much I can do about there. What else? I have a new clip for my hair. You, you can see my eye. My eye. It's real. Yeah, that sounded weird. Anyway, it's much bigger and therefore holds my hair back better than the other one and that's a good thing so now you can see my face kind of I guess apart from the bit that's still covered with hair that is irrelevant more importantly the final thing I have to tell everyone today is that I have someone that I would like to introduce you to he's not going to be a big part in my vlogs my bloggers may have heard about him a bit um, but I just wanted to clear up a few facts. Last year, The X Factor had a couple of twins who became sort of UK sensations for their crazy hair and the crazy clothes called Jedward. Now, um, when I first introduced my new friend to, um, well, not new, quite old friend, to my bloggers, they asked why he looked like Jedward. And I feel the need to clear this up and explain that he doesn't look like Jedward. Jedward looked like him. Now, I don't know how they found him, and I don't know why they decided to copy him. I mean, maybe he's a fashion icon. It's certainly possible. But either way, I would like you guys to meet Bert. This is Bert. The light is now glaring on Bert, so I shall move him. This is Bert. He's a chick with um, a quiff. Now if you're not seeing the resemblance then frankly I think you're mad because they could be triplets. They could be triplets. Only he was born in 2004, well not born, probably made in some Chinese factory in 2004, long before Jedward came up with the, the Jedward hair. Yeah, it's Bert's hair. Anyway, so Bert may be popping in now and again. He tends to do that sort of takeover. Anyway, yeah, that's about it. So now that I've told you about the blossom in my bed, the spider on my ceiling, oh my fucking... Ah! Anyway, he's very close to me. It's scaring me. And um, Bert, you've met Bert. I think that is pretty much all I was going to do today. So I will see you in the next few days or week or whenever I decide to talk to you all again, and hopefully you will keep listening. Thank you.